Cartesianism is the philosophical and scientific system of René Descartes and its subsequent development by other 17th-century thinkers, most notably Nicolas Malebranche and Baruch Spinoza. Descartes is often regarded as the first thinker to emphasize the use of reason to develop the natural sciences. For him, the philosophy was a thinking system that embodied all knowledge, and expressed it in this way. Cartesians view the mind as being wholly separate from the corporeal body. Sensation and the perception of reality are thought to be the source of untruth and illusions, with the only reliable truths to be had in the existence of a metaphysical mind. Such a mind can perhaps interact with a physical body, but it does not exist in the body, nor even in the same physical plane as the body. The question of how mind and body interact would be a persistent difficulty for Descartes and his followers, with different Cartesians providing different answers. Ontology Descartes held that all existence consists in three distinct substances, each with its own essence matter, possessing extension in three dimensions mind, possessing self-conscious thought God, possessing necessary existence Epistemology <inaudible> 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 Descartes brought the question of how reliable knowledge may be obtained epistemology to the fore of philosophical enquiry. Many consider this to be Descartes' most lasting influence on the history of philosophy. Cartesianism is a form of rationalism because it holds that scientific knowledge can be derived a priori from innate ideas through deductive reasoning. Thus Cartesianism is opposed to both Aristotelianism and empiricism, with their emphasis on sensory experience as the source of all knowledge of the world. For Descartes, the faculty of deductive reason is supplied by God and may therefore be trusted because God would not deceive us. Geographical dispersal In the Netherlands, where Descartes had lived for a long time, Cartesianism was a doctrine popular mainly among university professors and lecturers. In Germany the influence of this doctrine was not relevant and followers of Cartesianism in the German-speaking border regions between these countries e.g., the iatromathematician Y. V. O. Gockies from East Frisia frequently chose to publish their works in the Netherlands. In France, it was very popular, and gained influence also among Jansenists such as Antoine Arnauld, though there also, as in Italy, it became opposed by the Church. In Italy, the doctrine failed to make inroads, probably since Descartes' works were placed on the Index Librorum Prohibitorum in 1663. In England, because of religious and other reasons, Cartesianism was not widely accepted. Though Henry Moore was initially attracted to the doctrine, his own changing attitudes toward Descartes mirrored those of the country quick acceptance, serious examination with accumulating ambivalence, final rejection". Notable Cartesians Antoine Arnauld Balthasar Becker Tommaso Campella Johannes Klauberg Michelangelo Fardella Antoine Le Grand Adrian Haribord Nicolas Malebranche, Francois Paulin de la Barre, Edmund Perchot, Pierre Sylvain Regis, Henricus Regius, Jacques Rahalt, Christopher Wittich. Topic. See also. Dualism. Meditations on first philosophy. Mentalism, psychology. Simulism Topic References Topic Bibliography Francisque Boulier, Histoire de la philosophie cartésienne, 2 volumes, Paris, Durand 1854, reprint, Bibliobazar 2010. Édouard Jan Dijkster who is Descartes et le cartésianisme hollandais. Etudes et Documents Paris, PUF 1951. Tad M. Schmaltz ed. Receptions of Descartes. Cartesianism and Anti-Cartesianism in Early Modern Europe New York, Routledge 2005. Richard A. Watson, The Downfall of Cartesianism 1673–1712. A Study of Epistemological Issues in Late 17th-Century Cartesianism The Hague, Martinus Nijhoff 1966.